morning everyone. Today is the first day of school, September 3rd, and I'm skating to school. It's gonna be fun. All right, so I'm rolling up on the campus right now, and a little bit I'm probably gonna have to get off my board because at BYU they don't allow skateboards or longboards on campus, so it kinda sucks. And I'm gonna have to walk the way, rest of the way to class, but oh well. All right, so there's a whole lot of buildings on campus that I still don't know, but the one I do know is the library. I've been there a lot during the summer, and so now I have my first class, which is Japanese 301. It just kind of sucks that it's at 8 a.m., but I'll find a way to, to press on and stay awake. So I made it, I found the classroom, and I found my buddy Napcho and Johnson Shimai. So we're gonna have a fun Japanese class. It's gonna be lit. Oh, Genki. <laughs> so Japanese class was actually pretty cool. It split into Monday, Wednesday, Friday classes, and then Tuesday and Thursday. On Monday, Wednesday, Friday, we're supposed to speak only Japanese, and we meet with our TA and we just do like a lot of uh, in-class work that evaluates performance. And then Tuesday, Thursday, we are just learning and reviewing grammar in English with our actual professor. It's pretty cool. Uh, it was really fun because I got to see like five or six of the people that I served with in Japan. So uh, it's gonna be a great semester. Now I am heading to my religion class. If you didn't know, at BYU, you have to take a religion class for each semester. They'll just cover different things like the New Testament, Book of Mormon. It's really close. Just that building over there. It's like a couple minute walk away from my Japanese class. So yeah, class number two. So I just finished uh, the Book of Mormon class. The religion classes at BYU, they are not just like seminary or institute. It's more of just like going through what specific people said in the book and you know, uh, clarifying it, how to apply it into our lives. So it's pretty cool and I'm really excited to take it because there's always more to learn about the Book of Mormon and the other scriptures. So for today, that is my last class. Uh, I'm just gonna go to the library and check out some books as well as like read more on the syllabus and start some homework. All right, so I just stood in a really long line for my book. I just had to pick up like one physical test book and the rest are actually online. So They'll save me a lot of space in my room and I don't have to throw anything away at the end of the semester. Right now it is about 10.30. I think at 12 I'm supposed to have like a, an appointment with the health center because I have to get like a tuberculosis test because I've lived outside the states within the last five years. Uh, and that's probably like a five minute ride from campus. So I'm just gonna stay here at the library for a little bit, uh, start doing some homework and we'll go from there. Right now I'm off to the Student Health Center to get my uh, TV test. I'm not too excited because I don't really like needles, but hopefully I can get over it. That's why I didn't want to park because there's way too many cars here. That actually wasn't that bad. The needle was pretty small and it took less than like 30 seconds. I got a pretty cool band-aid. Captain America, she knew it's my favorite hero, which it is, if you didn't know. Uh, now I'm just gonna head back to the apartment and probably do some video editing as well as read more syllabus stuff 
and then get ready for practice today at 3 o'clock. So, yeah, let's go. It's pretty nice just cruising throughout the city. Uh, I'm still a little bit scared because I'm a noob at boarding. So going down hills, I had to slow down a lot or just walk it. I didn't want to eat uh, dirt my first day of uh, school. So hopefully I will get better during the semester so I can ride at full speed. But yeah, it's pretty sweet. So that's more or less my first two my first two classes and I guess kind of my first day. I'm pretty exhausted just from like skateboarding, especially uphill. There's a lot of uphill uh, going up to the health center. So I was like fighting to get up the hill. One of my goals for this school year is to just try to talk to everyone. I'm normally like a pretty quiet person. So if no one comes to talk to me first, I usually don't go out of my way and you know say hi. To them and start a conversation but this year I'm going to change that because my mission helped me to learn the importance of talking to everyone I think everyone wants to be talked to plus it's just a really good way to meet new people and make new friends especially since I moved from California to BYU the only people I know up here are probably like my mission buddies any effort to make new friends would really help and you get a lot more out of your college experience when you talk to people and instead of just you know, sitting in your room and studying and whatnot. I did a little bit of it today, just some self-introductions, and I felt really good about it. I could tell by other people's expressions that they were pretty happy to be talked to. Uh, some of them look like they're also pretty quiet like me, so maybe this could lead to like a little chain effect and everyone's talking to each other. That'd be sweet. All right, it's practice time. All right, I got shorts on now. Let's go. What is up guys? It's your boy, APL2 Real, coming at you live from Wanchai Chops YouTube channel. It's an honor to be with you today on our look inside the BYU drum line. Go Cukes. Color goes better. Shut up. Woo! <laughs> you... Woo! All right, so I'm rolled up at the stadium and we're about to go to practice. Tuesday and Thursday, it's only four to six. As opposed to Friday, it is three to six. So I'm gonna grab my stuff and run over to the field because I'm close to being late. Ready for that fall weather, baby. Let's go, man. The Nathan Winter. Oh, okay. Okay. Get it. Get it. We're Love about to that. tear it up, man. Let's go. <laughs> hey, my name's Trey. I have a basketball game tomorrow. I play point guard. My man Bryce here. What's up? Tell us something Welcome interesting. What? Tell us something interesting. Something interesting. Uh, I don't know. I'm a TA. I don't know. I'm on the He's... snare line at BYU. That's Ooh. interesting. <laughs> yeah, that's what's up. Say hello. Hello. He's my symbol, buddy. If you will look at your accent and your judo markings, you got three articulations. Do, da, dot. <laughs> You gotta got jump while you march. <laughs> Two words. <laughs> and with that, our rehearsal is over. That was the shortest marching rehearsal I've ever had. Usually they're like four or five hours, but it felt pretty short. I think it was like two hours today. It's the line. 
Hi Caleb. What's up? How's it going? What's up? Hey. Got the vlog. Wow, that's cool. <laughs> Did you see my talent? She's got talent. She's showing you up. Give me my flag. You're not even telling me I'm cool or anything. So it's Tuesday and we're doing Taco Tuesday again. You excited? I'm pumped, man. Yeah. Tacos are where it's at. I love tacos. <laughs> Well, after passing yes, the sacrament. Really? <laughs> yeah. Really don't. Or after blessing the sacrament, when he excuses us, I was like, yes. <laughs> yes. Now I'm back home, and I'm gonna take a shower because I feel pretty gross in these sweaty clothes. It was pretty hot today, probably like 90, I think, and we were out in the field the whole time. So yeah, pretty sweaty, and I feel gross. I have about three more sections that I have to do for programming and it's just like the first few chapters of the textbook just like an introduction and then after that I'm gonna go through the learning suite again and look through for we'll look through it for any assignments that I need to do by tomorrow or the next couple days at least for me I find it's hard to know what's due and when it is because right now the online websites kind of buggy hopefully when I figure it out uh, I'll be able to get work done faster. So it's close to 11, and I think I'm just gonna wrap up for tonight. I got what I could done. There's a lot, especially the coding. I'm pretty new at coding, so it's there's a lot of things that I still don't understand, but we're gonna get there. Uh, I haven't been in school in three years, so I was expecting it to be uh, pretty hard, I guess. But it ended up being pretty well because uh, I tried to talk to everyone, and a lot of my classes were pretty fun. Uh, then again, it is the first day. I haven't actually started doing a whole lot of work, so that might change. But for a first day of just running over syllabi and uh, how everything works at BYU, I think it's pretty good. One thing that I can say that's going to help throughout this whole college experience, and it's definitely goal setting and planning. I'm probably going to pick like one day in the week to kind of look over the next week's uh, plans, like what's due, what I'm going to study, and then I'll make plans of, for each day on how I'm going to do that. So yeah, I'm pretty excited. And if you made it all the way to the end of this video, thank you so much for watching. Please give it a like, subscribe if you haven't already. I'm planning to make more videos of uh, more college videos as well as other random vlogs so feel free to stick around and I'll see you next time. Oh yes me.